The forum in Vladivostok has officially kicked off. Russia expects the gathering to bring in over $15 billion in investment to develop its Far East. Kim Yun Bin follows this report from the host city. Two and a half thousand representatives from 35 countries are in Vladivostok for the Eastern Economic Forum, which kicked off for a two day run on Friday. More than 300 Russian CEOs and executives from 80 international companies, including Korea, China, and Japan, are at the forum with the eye on sealing some lucrative deals for projects in the largely undeveloped region. The Eastern Economic Forum is an important step in Russia's economic development. It should enable us to assess the economic potential of Vladivostok and the rest of Russia's Far East. It helps that the leaders of countries like South Korea and Japan are coming here as it will provide extra impetus for investment in this region. The forum's goal is simple, to attract as much foreign investment as it can, with a particular focus on the energy and transport sectors. Vladivostok is home to special economic zones and offers tax breaks and infrastructural support to overseas investors. The forum's organizers say around 130 agreements worth 15.4 billion U.S. dollars will be signed at the Eastern Economic Forum this year. Kim Hyun-bin, News, Vladivostok.